what is up you guys it's june 16th 2021 in big bear lake we are going to go stay at the big bear frontier again but we're going to do a real video this time um, we're staying at their biggest spot the three bedroom two bathroom uh just right on the lake i think you guys are going to really like it with my local discount i paid with tax 460 dollars for the night 460 so if you guys real uh, recognize where we're at the village is this way we are just pulling up right up here and I'll show you, we'll do a little video of the outside of this place. And then obviously, dude, the drone video is gonna be so sick here, you guys. It's gonna be so nice. All right, this guy's a Barney. Going the wrong way, kook. All right, so this is the entry right here. Hang on a second, guys, we're walking up to the street right here. So you guys can just kind of see what this place looks like from the front in my hometown literally less than five minutes from my from my actual house so yeah check it out we have all these old little rustic whatever the hell they are looks like they were used for farming but i could be wrong i've been wrong once before but yeah so this is the big bear frontier i've stayed in this three bedroom one right here well actually it's, it's right there and then there's a two or one bedroom or something right there main office right here we're just gonna walk down here to the end and come back in so you guys can see but yeah this is the big bear frontier guys what i love about the room is its location it's my favorite location and guess what guys last night i, I met somebody who uh actually what should we call it uh Hang on a sec, guys. My focus got got taken away for a quick quick second, but uh, hang on. I met somebody who is staying in an Airbnb up here, and uh, he's a customer. But met him yesterday, and when I went to his Airbnb, you guys, it was one of the most. Actually, it was the most incredible view I've seen yet here. So I'm I'm getting that information for the people. It's for the week. It's twenty five hundred bucks for the whole week there. But yeah, um, for seven days. When you guys see the view, you'll think it should be that for one night. I've never seen a view like that in Big Bear. Never knew it existed. Anyway, we're right across the street over there, down by the lake. So anyway, we're not gonna record inside quite yet. This is the little, the little driveway here. This is the car that I got for my mommy. 2021 Subaru Forester, fully, fully loaded. And inside they have like drinks and stuff you, you can buy stuff like that if they let me record in there i'll do it hang on i'm getting some ice so we just walked in the door right here this is the door that's my car we made a left you know all these brochures right here just a bunch of stuff to come up in, in big bear have a good time just some information and then you got a little little nook over here to eat if you come out here i think they used to serve some sort of uh, breakfast I will not get them. That's the front counter. And then back here, a big fireplace right there. There's the soda machines, and you can get some candy and chips, whatever you guys want for the most part. Then right down the street is a liquor store, two liquor stores actually. There's one directly across the street. Here's your ice machine. I know my video is pretty crappy right now, but I am, uh, I don't know if they're too happy with me recording, even though I'm sure they could. You know, any business helps, right? Here you can get some basketballs. They have a basketball court here, swimming pool, all that good stuff. So anyway, walking back out through here. Beautiful. Very rusty. We didn't get to do too much of the tour because yeah, incredible from my other youtube channel staying at like five star hotels it's like the staffs are so much happier at the five stars maybe because the, if they aren't they get fired yeah here's the basketball court you know what? we're just gonna walk over to the pool instead of drive over here it's a small little area and from the front desk we can that is the pool area there's people in there, so I don't want to be too intrusive, but there's a pool and a jacuzzi. 
they do have a jacuzzi in the back left there. And I'll dunk on that later. <laughs> yeah, right. All right. Cool, guys. The village is right here. You turn left out of here, and the village is just right there. There's the Chevron. You just keep on going straight past there, and you're good. All right, so now let's drive to the room. Let's drive to the room, man. Hang on a second. You know what's kind of cool? My phone, I just got a phone call and the, the caller ID is Compton. Oh, watch out, bunny rabbit. Don't do, no, don't, no. Oh. Gosh, man, they all have death wishes. I can't see him. I hope he doesn't jump back. Please don't jump back across. I can't see you. Please don't. Please don't. All right, cool. And then they have a lot of these little tiny one, one bedroom little studio cabins and all this stuff, but we're staying in the biggest one this place offers. Okay, and this is part of it. I think I think this is like their little hotel part, but we stay in their their cabins. The cabins are much 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 better. This is a great location. But look at the cab. So this is Frontier Two. This is the second half of Big Bear Frontier. We're just gonna drive to the end and show you where I stayed before. Put the seatbelt on so it doesn't keep on being annoying like that. Sorry guys. So I've stayed down. We make a right right here. Hang on. Shut up, guys. My bad. Okay, so I've stayed in this room down here. It's a, it's a little, or it's a, it's a big one bedroom with a second bed that you can pull out near the kitchen down here at the end. This was the first nice place I stayed out up here. I treated my mom, she's here with me now. That's why I'm staying here. But this doesn't count for one of the five stars on my other channel, so unfortunately I can't do this hotel. But yeah, this is where we stayed right here. And that other building right next to it, that's where we're staying now in the big three bedroom, right in front on the lake. Just amazing, guys. Look at that. Isn't that great? Just beautiful. And then you got all these little private little picnic areas and stuff, guys. Just so cool. This is such a cool place. This is such a cool place. As I said, man, like, like I'm telling you, if I opened a hotel up here, the attitudes would be so much different towards the customers. I'd be making so much money because you guys would feel so comfortable and like want to ask questions. I'm afraid to like ask these people anything. It's sad. But anyway, yeah, so Big Bear Frontier 2. This is where we are going. There's my car right there. And we are in this three bedroom. I'll wait till my mom goes. She's gonna be leaving in a minute to, to, to go help one of you guys actually. She's doing some real estate stuff for, for one of my, my YouTube friends. How cool is that? Yeah, man. She loves helping you guys out, dude. So anyway, appreciate it. And I'll get on this uh, video again shortly. Peace. It's going to be a little darker next time. though. All right, you guys, it's a few hours later and we are going to do a walk through the house right now of the cabin we're staying in at the frontier, the big bear frontier. We stayed here before, but I didn't really do like too formal of a video. And I thought we would do it this time with the drone and everything. So very cool. Room number 30, it's their largest one here. So, well, that's why when you walk in, just, just a nice old, old rustic feel. Very comfortable. That view right there, geez. And check this place out. There we go, let's go in through here. That's where we just entered from. This whole length of the place is ours. All right. Oh, nice, nice fireplace here. Let me back up a little bit. Sorry, guys. I know I'm kind of all over the place. I'm trying to do the best I can. Let's see. So. Wow, look at that view. Gosh. And this is looking back down the hallways. We just came into that through that red door. Now let's go back into the kitchen area. And we'll, actually let's check out the view first from from this from this room. So we walk out on our patio right here. 
and we can go out to the end here. It's so pretty. <laughs> wow. And here's my car to the left there. Look at that. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> you guys having fun? <laughs> it's so pretty, yeah? Wow, so pretty. Have a great time. Thank you very much. Uh, see, guys, this is, yeah, when you're out here, this is just happiness. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. So the water used to come right up to where the sand ends right there. That's the observatory out there. We'll do some, uh, as I said, the drone will be able to see a lot better over here. The drone is charging up as we speak. All right, let's go. Check this out. We got all these little beach chairs for us here because we're special. Little table, barbecue. Anyway, let's come back in. Let's go into the kitchen. The kitchen's huge, guys. Lots of storage. Beautiful views, once again, of everything. Look at this. You sit right there and look at the views all around you. And there's a door right here that we can access. We can access to let us out there. But yeah, so when you walk in, if you turn to the right in the kitchen, this is what you see. It's beautiful. Just so comfortable. There's my drone sitting in there. But yeah, look at this. Right here at the window. Let's just take a look right here. Yeah, this is so beautiful. I'm very lucky to live in a place like this. Okay, so here's the rest of the kitchen. This window goes through, you can see the master in this place, in there. Wait till you guys see that. This place is great, guys. I mean, for for what I paid, yeah, it's great. All these little storage stuff, all of these, look, look how adorable there. Cool stuff, man. But anyway, let's see. Dishwasher, you have a, Microwave oven, or yeah, microwave. We have an oven, stoves right behind us. They have all the, just do your dishes and stuff when you're done. They have all this stuff. Nothing to do. Down here though, for cooking and stuff. Oh yeah, guys. So this is a great place. All your stuff right there, heck yeah. So yeah, this is, uh, sorry once again about the really crappy camera, camera work, but, but yeah, look at this, just sitting over here, washing your dishes and you turn around and look at that. <laughs> okay, let's go out through here. We've already seen this main room in here. Now let's go down the hallway. Let's back up so we can get a good view of the hallway. Okay, hang on a second. We're gonna go into the master first. Obviously, I gave my mom the master. So, when you walk in, right to the right, you've got your TV, your chair. Very comfortable, thick, thick, thick chair right there. And then, nice views. Just beautiful views, you guys. So let's go inside here and let's check out the view from their window, their patio. You get your own private patio in the master back here. It's a big, big patio, you guys. Once again, we get just the incredible views. Let's go back out here just once. Look at that, the sun right there. So look at this place. Okay guys, so here we go. We're gonna go into the bedroom again, the master. And here's the bed, obviously. 
Oops, let me turn that off. I wanted to have every light on like I'm showing a house. Oh, that one doesn't have any light. That's right, the light bulb. The bed's comfortable. I've already slept on these beds before. They're very comfortable. So yeah, so this is your view when you're laying in bed and you wake up in the morning, you're just like, oh, hello. Hello. All right, got the fan on super high. It got up to 92 degrees up here today, guys. I think that might be a record or close to it, if not. A... Anyway, here's the bathroom part of it. Oh yeah, I went golfing today. That's why I'm dressed like this. Um, obviously work too, but I went golfing earlier and I just haven't changed. It was too busy. So yeah, we got a big jacuzzi bathtub in here as well. Oh yeah. Look at how big this thing is. Huge. Big, big bathroom. Then let's check out this walk-in closet. This thing's freaking humongous too, you guys. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. Jeez, look at how big this is. Okay, hang on a second. So yeah, so we're in the walk-in closet and then we're gonna go back out here, take a look at the shower and then the bathroom in here. So here's the shower. It's a really big shower as well. You got a step to climb up here. And there's the shower. Just your standard shower, but it's really, really big. And back here is the restroom. Pretty, just chill little spot. I like the toilet paper roll holders. Got a nice rustic appeal to it. Yeah, so when we're getting out, we walk through here. Watch your step. Okay, let's take a bath. I'm gonna take a bath tonight. I'm gonna, I'm gonna soak in that thing for sure because I don't get to do that often. So yeah, so we're gonna leave the master bedroom and go to the other two rooms in this little place here. Down this hallway, we turn right. Oh, there's another hallway. Look at that, guys. So when we came in the front door, that's the front door to the right. And then we just made a left and went through here all the way back here. And now we are going down this hall. And there's a lot of storage in this hallway as well. We can see up on the walls up there on the left for what you guys need when you guys are here for a while. Because I imagine if you get like eight people together in this place, it's not gonna cost you guys but 50 bucks a night. So another closet right here. <laughs> Huge closet. Jeez, fan after fan after fan. I wonder what kind of operation they do on the, on the side in here. I'm just kidding. All right, so here's a bathroom for the, for these other two bedrooms as I run into the wall. All right, let's see. It's a full bathroom. Another nice rustic toilet paper roll holder. I dig that. And just for your regular towels. Let's walk in here and check out the bathtub. Yeah, that's your standard bathtub. There's my car right there outside. Another towel rack right here. And then, yeah. There we are. More drawers, stuff like that. Let's go check out the last two bedrooms. So we go through this door right here and you have a separate door over here if you want. You Like if you have a bunch of drunk people in your crew, they can come in through that door if you guys are trying to get some sleep on this side of the house. But yeah, this is the Big Bear Frontier Hotel. So look here, here's, here's the bed in this room. As soon as you walk in, right here on the left. You got your own little fridge and, and microwave back here. So you, if you don't want to bug other people in, in the house, I don't see why you would be bugging people because this is about sharing and having a good time with the people you love. So yeah, so here's the entrance in, into, so yeah, the other entrance into this room. And so when you come in through that entrance, this is what you will see.
Let me do this real quick. There we go. That's a lot better. Okay. So this is one room, and then you get to the other bedroom through this room. Look at that. There's the other bedroom. The other bedroom has the TV on the wall, so I'm going to sleep in this room tonight. Yeah, so when you walk in, there's extra pillows, stuff like that. Just a cute room, guys. It really is. Hang on a second. So this is the other bedroom, guys. I apologize, I'm not doing the best job with the camera, but I'm trying. All right, so let me open this a little bit. See, oh, that's that's the next the next door building. But yeah, we have the biggest one they have in the whole joint. Well, actually, they have a five bedroom, but I think it's it's less expensive than this one, to be honest. They have a five bedroom one, but it's it's up by the main the main office. So when we come out through that room, we turn left and we go back down through these hallways and our tour of this house is done. Remember, if we make a left, we go to the master or the master view or we go to the right, go to the rest of the house and just enjoy it. All right, guys, that's the Big Bear Frontier. And I said I will be putting some drone video together soon. Peace out, guys. Yeah, take care. Oh, sh <laughs> All right, you guys, it's uh, June 16th, 2021 at the Big Bear Frontier. Let's go take this drone for a little flight. It's the evening time, but I think it's going to be pretty. Take off. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Turn around and uh, check out the place. We'll fly over it low style. <laughs> okay, so where we are, let me. Okay, my bad guys. I need to do a little better job with this. So we are in this one. You see me right there in that house on the left down, down below. We're going to go down a little bit. There's my mom's car right there. So we're just gonna, so these, this whole place is part of the resort. We'll get a higher flight at it, but we're just gonna go to the other side real quick. Hang on. So across the highway, this, or this little road right here is the other part of the hotel. And we gotta fly up above it, unfortunately, so we don't crash. So now we're right on top of the other part of the hotel. I already showed all you guys, I showed you guys this earlier, but let's just take a look. Then we'll go up to the front and turn around. Let's just show you guys where we're at. I know this is a pain in the butt for you guys to have to sit through this, but so that's the village right there, right over there. And we are right here. We're going to just turn around. I know we're gonna back up so we can see it from the front. I hope I don't hit anything I'm backing up, I can't see. Oh. Uh, I think I'm, I'm doing the right thing. <laughs> Okay, so right there, that is the Big Bear Frontier. Right there. Let's go to the pool area. There 
there's the pool. Why don't we, uh, let's kind of cl close in on them a little bit, huh? Have a little fun. <laughs> I guess this isn't that much fun. <laughs> but yeah, that's the pool area right there. Forget it, we're not gonna mess with them. Now we're gonna do a little view of town from up above. That's Big Bear Boulevard right there. There's Magic Mountain, our little snow play area with a bobsled and all that good stuff. As a matter of fact, why don't we fly over there? Let's go check it out. We're gonna fly a bit up. We're gonna fly high. So you can see it. There we go. This place is fun, you guys. It's right next to this hotel. Look at all this fun you guys can have. Sledding, bob sledding. Well, sledding in the wintertime. Yeah, we're gonna turn this around a little bit so we can kind of see what's going on here. We're gonna climb a bit. We got the first couple minutes of this. We'll see. Wow, oh, look at that. We're gonna climb, we need to climb. That's really pretty. I hope you guys can see okay. There you go, it's a little better. And then when we pan up for the hotel, or the, for the sunset. Mm. This is gorgeous. We're climbing, guys. Let's pan back up now. We should have gone up quite a bit. Yeah. It's beautiful. Let's just take a look over here. Maximum flight altitude reached. There's Big Bear Boulevard. And the ski resorts. There's Snow Summit right there. Yeah, let's uh, turn around again. There's San Gorgonio, you guys, up there. And beyond our good focus. But it's night. Or it's getting late, so we're going to scroll over here real quick. And just... Wow, look at that. Just so beautiful. All right, you guys. Well, this is going to be it. We're going to head back home now. So, let's go back home. I'm going to fly it directly on the path that we flew here. See if I can make it back perfectly. I can hear it. Wow, that is so pretty, you guys. Oh, 
Yeah, I can hear it now. Oh, there it is. Wow, it's pretty good. Turn around here and look at us here, and then we'll fly to come land. Woohoo! Coming into the place, actually. It won't let me out of here. Because it's on the protective mode. landing all right guys hope you enjoyed that